right off the bat you got Chris Weber trying to be a badass like he thought he was or something and Kobe throwing elbows this is game two everybody Sacramento versus Shaq and Kobe 2002 game six right game six yeah game six 2002 look at Chris Weber being a little bitch Bill Walton getting all offended. Here comes Kobe. Whew, and one. Look at how much different Kobe was because he was like cocky and really young and kind of immature or less mature. Hmm. I don't know where that foul is, but we'll take it. There it goes. This was a huge series. So big. Shaq is on a different level this game. This is one of Shaq's best games right here. It's game six. Western Conference Finals. 2002. Kobe, fucking assassin. There's that baby hook. Shaq's signature right there. One of his two shots that he had. A layup. He just pretty much would plant down there. Set his roots. <laughs> Grow roots there and just stay. Back to check. Oh, look at Pollard get done. Ooh, the big fella. The big fella channeling. Channeling his inner Hakeem right there. The big fella with the quick spin and push. That's a big fella too, turning like that. It's a lot of weight. Probably shot Pollard off. The goddamn gravity. Oh, Shaq's feeling it. What is that? Is that is that another move? Did he learn a new move? Like a third one? Oh my god. That's four that's four separate moves I just saw. Huh. I didn't know Shaq had four moves. Oh my. Oh my. Pollard. Just yeah, I don't know where the foul, the foul is. You gotta give something to Pollard. I mean, what can he do? <sighs> yeah. What else can he? What else can he do? Here comes Kobe again. Man, both of them are on fire. Nice finesse move. Sorry, Peja. I don't know what you think you can do, but it's not guard Kobe Bryant. You're fucking European, dude. You should be playing football. And not American football. Nice shot, Shaq. That's a little out of sight of your range, big fella. You better bring it in. That's like a three ball for you. Big pass. There we go. See, when Kobe's passing to Shaq, you know it's good. You know it's good game. It's good game time when Kobe's passing to Shaq. I knew Kobe, I know Kobe had to get had to move on from the Shaquille O'Neal situation so that he could grow. But man, fuck! I wish he would have got over that bullshit. Fuck! I wish he would have got over that bullshit. Wow, Mike Bibby. Do you see fucking Mike Bibby blocker? Mike Bibby's from uh, Shadow Mountain here in Arizona, too. And he blocked fucking Shaquille O'Neal at some point in time. Crazy. Pollard didn't, though. Holy fuck, Pollard. Just re just get it. How'd you get in the league in the first place? I didn't know they needed everlast-looking motherfuckers in the league back then. 
God damn. Look like Everlast fucking older brother. Getting dunked on. Shaq hit a free throw. There's some arch in that one too. I don't know if you remember that game from 2000. <laughs> game 7 against the Trailblazers. There was no arch. The fucking rim almost came off. There goes Shaq again. He's feeling it. Yeah, he does. Unstoppable. Unstoppable that game. I think he had a little help from the refs. I think all the, the Lakers did. Got it again. Oh my. Whew. Man, when I was a kid, I came so far out of my chair. I believe this was a Sunday. NBA on NBC. Sunday evening, if I can recall. I don't recall staying in my seat very much for this game. Shaq hitting. Oh. Oh. Kobe gets away. Ooh. Ooh. Splits the D and the foul. Huh. I'm not. I didn't quite see one, but it is a little grainy. That analog bullshit sucks. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see what's going on. Oh. Hmm. Oh. That's. Yeah, I agree. That's that's probably two fouls. I'm pretty sure I saw two. Hey. Yeah. It's a legitimate question because I don't see Kobe get fouled right there. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting. It's the Staples Center, though. They're going to get some calls. Shaq is getting... All the calls, though. Huh. Did, did Shaq, like, do some seances before the game? Because he's making shots. Did he, like, sacrifice some children or something? Oh, my God. What? Kobe. Don't do him so dirty. Man, come on. You're going to make someone cry. and kill themselves after the game. Over and over. It's almost annoying. I just don't believe that's a foul. It seems kind of lopsided in that sense. When I was a kid, I didn't notice that. So biased because my Kobe obsession. But now, today, it's a grown-ass man. That's... It looks pretty biased. In the call... In the, in the, uh, in the foul calling game at least in the foul calling part of the game but Shaq still can't miss though can't give him that Vlade getting blocked look at them big old mitts big old sausages there's Kobe again he's been playing great ball too Ooh, wow he does almost like the, a full 180 as he's in the air watch this here he is here Ooh. He continues that spin. It's crazy. He, did, he didn't spin that extensively later on in his career. Yeah, but that's not Paige's ball. Did you hear that? It was Paige's ball. Yeah, it was Paige's ball if he wasn't European and soft. That's not it. I, I'm not knocking all my European buddies. I'm just, just talking shit to talk shit. Don't mean anything by it. Kobe hits free throws in the playoffs. That's surprising. At least back then it was. He had a lot of nerve in the... A lot of nervousness in the playoffs back then. At least at the line, it seemed. Shot a way worse percentage. It's almost like Shaq shot a better one. Shaq can't be stopped. He's unstoppable this fucking game. Man, we needed all those, too. We needed all those points. Because, look, it's still 94-93. Game's still close. Mike Clary is laying on the ground. Let's see. Yeah, see that playoff percentage? 71. That's 12% underneath his average for the season. That's that's bad. That's not good. 
Here's uh, Shaq. Let's see if he can miss. Let's see if he can miss. Wow. Oh, my God. Damn, I've never seen Shaq pull that off. Maybe, like, 94, 95, max. When he still was under 600 pounds, even. Kobe's hitting him. That's good. Kind of surprising. What the fuck was that? Hey, Turk. Turk. Ooh, what happened there? I didn't even see that. Who's laying on the ground? Is that Mike? Oh, that's, that's Mike, baby. And there's... Oh, damn. Kobe fucking elbowed him right in the fucking roof of the nose. Hey, oh, my God. Damn. How did... Kobe not get called for that. Holy shit, that was fucking a Ron Artest type of move right there. I, think, I thought I saw a middle world piece in the middle of the, in the middle of the court. Wow, surprising. But a great game for the Lakers, regardless. You can't take away their shooting percentage. You can't take away the fact that Kobe's sinking them. Shaq was sinking him. Great game. Great game. A little few questionable Robert Ory, Ron Artest type of plays, but uh, great game regardless. Either way. And then we all know what happens in Game 7. And if you don't, stay tuned because we'll be watching that one too. Thanks for watching. Come back. Watch some more. Watch Kobe uh, fuck shit up. Watch, it, watch when the NBA was fun. When it was enjoyable. When it was aggressive. When it wasn't LeBron James NBA.